Well, 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 folks. You may know that I'm a Mega Constructs YouTube channel at heart, but I cannot escape the fact that Jazzware has been crushing it with their toys over the last year and a half. Like, absolutely destroying the toy competition. It's outrageous. Hello once again, YouTube, and welcome back to The Domain. This is gonna be a news video of sorts. I am currently outside. Uh, I'm barefoot, and the ground is very, very hot. And it's Peggy's birthday this weekend, and we're going away all weekend. But I just thought I needed to get one video out. I can't leave you guys hanging for three days. That's ridiculous. So I thought I'd do this quick little news video video going over the brand new Jazzware toys that have come out or have just been teased over the last couple of weeks. It's not very clear if they're in some locations or if they're just teased right now. They've been ringing up on cash registers and we have to talk about it because the line of figures that they're releasing is is simply outrageous. I've done so many Jazzware news videos over the last like couple of months. They've got the new Mantis, the Gun Goose, all these different vehicles, the shade turret, loads of figures, and now we've got a brand new line of World of Halo and Spartan Collection. Not really Spartan Collection, but that's the name of all, all these new toys. And also, you may have noticed that this is not a very well edited video, because I gotta get out, I gotta get to this birthday, so this is gonna be a very quick, cut-down video as best I can, but I hope you enjoy it. Anyway, my feet are on fire right now. <laughs> okay, so, Jazzware, if you've not been familiarized with it, they have two waves of Halo toys. The World of Halo, three and three quarter inches, almost four inch toys. And these ones, up until this point, have 100% focused on figures and vehicles and weapons releasing in Halo Infinite. And then the second range is the Spartan Collection, six inch figures, which are like highly detailed and just your favorite Spartans from around the Halo universe. Makes sense, right? Now, this is where it gets a bit weird because I'm gonna go down all the new figures that have been been sort of rung up on cash registers and there are a lot and you may notice that they don't fit the current criteria we have for World of Halo and Spartan Collection toys. So first of all we've got Spartan Collection toys and there are a lot of them. Keep in mind these are the six inch, they're more expensive but more detailed. First of all we have Spartan Carter from Halo Reach, Spartan Alice from Red Team, Spartan Frederick from Blue Team and then Noble Six randomly just a noble six and a spartan rogue rogue is one of my personal all-time favorite armors from halo 3 so i'm really happy about that i really do hope it's in halo 3 armor style usually with the spartan collection you have some named figures and then some random iconic spartans as well that is our iconic spartan spartan rogue very excited about that one now the funny thing about it is they are all listed as 1999 retail but there are two figures in the set that are retailing for more money. They're actually $34.99, almost double the costs, and these two are Sergeant Johnson and the Arbiter. I don't know why these two are more expensive. It would be cool if Sergeant Johnson came with the Guilty Spark, but I really don't know at this point. I don't know why those two are $34.99 versus the regular $19.99 of all the others. If you guys know the info, comment down below. But then we've got the weirdest of all of these figures. It's a two-pack and I kid you not, this is real, it's called Cortana versus Atriox Halo 5. I don't know if you guys play Halo 5, but I don't remember Atriox being in the game. <laughs> I don't think he was even conceptualized yet. So it's a very, very strange thing. Cortana versus Atriox. I want to think it's to do with Halo Infinite, but it specifically says Halo 5. That might also be a red herring. I cannot wait to find out why. There is a two-pack for $16.99 called Cortana versus Atriox. What is that? That is so strange. But we are not done yet. This is the world of Halo line. Three and three quarter inches. Now, as I said, three and three quarter inches is they are usually just centered around Halo Infinite. They're just Halo Infinite toys. It seems like they're doing a 180 now and producing figures from across all the Halo games. We've got Spartan Jerome from Red Team, ODST Book, Spartan George from Noble Team, Felvdam, Wow, this is crazy. Sergeant Johnson again in both World of Halo 3 and 3 quarter and Spartan Collection 7 inch, 6 inch. Yes, yeah, six. A Spartan Academy figure, it's just named as Spartan Academy. Then Elite Zealot, Suicide Grunt, Pilot Number Two. I imagine that's gonna be a re-release of Brohammer ready for Halo Infinite launching. And then 
the most interesting from this lot, an elite ultra with a cinder shot. A cinder shot. I don't know what that is, but this might be a brand new weapon being teased on this channel. Cinder shot, you heard it here first. We got we got the elite ultra with cinder shot. Oh man. So to recap the list, Spartan collection, we've got Sergeant Johnson, Arbiter, Carter, Alice, Frederick, Spartan Rogue, Noble Six, then Cortana versus Atriox two pack. We've got World of Halo, Jerome, ODST Book, George, Thelva Dam, Sergeant Johnson, Spartan Academy, Elite Zealot, Suicide Grunt, Pilot Number Two, and Elite Ultra with Cinder Shot. Damn, that's a list. Damn, that's a good list, eh? Whoa. What is going on? Guys, that is all the news I have for today. And I must dash. I got a lot of errands to do today. I really shouldn't be recording this, but I wanted to give you something to sink your teeth into today. Some more Halo news. I know I'm a bit late with this one, but hey, Halo news is timeless as long as I don't, as long as the toy doesn't get released and then it's not news at all. But yeah, thanks very much for supporting this video, guys. Please do like and share it if you want to spread it around, subscribe and keep it with the domain for all your Halo toy news. And we'll see you next time. The domain is signed. Off. Let me know in the comments which figure you're looking forward to the most.